Thanks for tuning in to WSKI TV 17. It's time for your latest local forecast brought to you, as always, by Geppetto's, the place to be anytime, day or night, located right up in Village West. And we've got some high pressure moving into our area, which is going to give us some uh, partly cloudy, partly sunny skies pretty much right throughout the weekend. Today we're looking at summit temperatures 16 to 20, base temperatures 23 to 27, so fairly comfortable out there. A north-northwest wind up top could be noticeable around 15 to 30 miles an hour. Uh, not too bad down here around the base. And as we look ahead towards the weekend, we'll see partly to mostly sunny skies for the day on Saturday, a high of 26 up towards the summit. A uh, high of 28 down here around the base, so another uh, great December day here at the mountain to get in some great uh, skiing and riding or just being outside here in Maine's High Peaks region. Looking ahead at our extended forecast, Sunday we'll see partly sunny skies, a high of 29. Things start to warm up the beginning of next week, partly sunny skies for Monday with a high of 31. And then Tuesday we'll see some weather come our way. Hopefully we'll be on the snow side, but it looks like temperatures will be uh, quite mild, so we should get some mixed precip out of that as well. These regular midweek storms, at least something's happening. Birchwood Interiors, they're located in Village West. You can find them online at birchwoodinteriors.com. Bracket Basin is open, 124 trails to ski and ride on, nine lifts getting into those runs, 25 trails got groomed last night. We did receive uh, eight or so inches of new snow uh, throughout the uh, Wednesday into Thursday, so it's skiing and riding great out there. Skidway, Sawduster, Dub Runner East, and Snubber will get going this morning at 8.30. Those lifts move you around the base area. Skyline and Super Quad are scheduled to get going at 8.30 as well. Skyline gets you up to Spillway Crosscut, which allows you to branch out all across the mountain. Super Quad gets you to all the mid-mountain trails as well as Bullwinkles if you head west right off a of tote road. Wiffle Tree, King Pine, and Timberline, those are scheduled uh, this morning at 9 a.m. Wiffle Tree with an H. King Pine, that gets you over towards Bracket Basin, and Timberline gets you up to the summit, uh, right just below the summit of the second highest mountain here in Maine. Scheduled grooming for last night, Tote Road, King's Landing, Hayburner, Comp Hill, Narrow Gauge, Sluice, as well as Gandhi Line, Lower Winter's Way on there, uh, Candy Side Boardwalk, the Landing and the Birches, also East Mountain Trails like Ram Down and Wiffle Tree with an H, Timberline, Bridal Chain, and Stomping Grounds. Those were on the scheduled snowmaking for last night. They are still making snow uh, up there as well as temps permit. So those snowmakers back at it while they can get on it. 30K open and groom for skiing and snowshoeing down at the Sugarloaf Outdoor Center. 15K for snowshoeing. Bakery opens this Saturday. Skating rink is just looking for some cold temperatures, which don't really seem to be in the near future. So take advantage of that great Nordic skiing, a great alternative to alpine skiing. And the rack down at the bottom of the access road, want to let you know this Saturday from 5 to 8.30, they've got the local craft fair in the loft. So go check that out. Buy some great local gifts. Uh, they've got live music all weekend as well. So go check out the rack. WSKITV.com, you can find this latest local forecast, including our live quad cam shot and lots more. Tons of info to keep you busy while you're here in Maine's High Peaks region.